Hi, it's been uh, it's Andy, and that's been night five camping up at uh, Mason Lake, and then busy, uh, Perkins Clearing, different campsites. Split it up three nights at Mason's Lake, or a little bit south of Mason's Lake, and then here. So it was only three nights at each site, well, three nights at the one, two at the other. You know, falls into the, the uh, state limit of three nights. It's been a working vacation. I came up here on Friday. I worked all day Friday, worked Monday. I didn't get Memorial Day off. And then I uh, uh, worked today, Tuesday. I'm gonna work tomorrow, Wednesday, down spec there and then drive home at five o'clock. I decided to stay up here a few extra days because of the heat wave. It's gonna be, it was 90 some odd degrees today and it's gonna be 90 tomorrow. And well, I don't have air conditioning here. I also don't have air conditioning at home. It's a little bit cooler out here in the mountains. But it is a beautiful evening for sure. Uh, this is provided, this uh, screen house has been perfect for staying uh, bug free. Not very good for shade. Has great views from inside of it, but the shade's not so good. Um, so I would definitely, I've had to string a tarp up. And also when we get some rain, I string a tarp over the side to keep the rain from blowing in because the angled sides. Although I like the angle sides for the uh, the views from out of the sky and stuff. So um, yeah, I couldn't work. To, I couldn't go kayaking today. So the kayaking kind of a trash boat. So I just been stacking the trash there. Um, lots of beer cans and the day's trash. I don't know if I'm gonna have a fire tonight, so it probably won't get burnt. But uh, got my "Don't Tread on Me" flag and the uh, U.S. flag. I didn't feel like I'm gonna ball three flags, and it's a little tight in this site with the. The bushes to hang up all the flags. And this campsite, as always, has great views of the mountains. And uh, yeah, it's been a great, it's been a good, great getaway for five, five nights, um, and um, six days. It'll actually be when I, by the time I leave to get head home. Um, yeah, tomorrow I'm gonna work down speculator, just hang out there. It's red. Trying to keep things neat. Uh, I'm running low on clothes and food. Cause I don't really expect to be here three nights so I packed for four nights and then I saw the forecast and I'm like I'm gonna stay here for another day I mean I have good cell service here I have uh, you know computer with uh, internet so for work stuff and I have my cell phone too to use for all other things and uh, yeah just kind of relaxing black flies been bad because it is uh, it is Memorial Day weekend it was Memorial Day weekend but that greenhouse really works well with the black flies. A few of them get in, but you you can slap them and and they will uh, you, know, you can get rid of them. I've used a lot less uh, DEET and Picarin and PMD this year with uh, the black flies because I haven't needed as much. I just hide out in the tent when the, they're really bad in the daytime. They don't come out to the evening. Although I'm out now and I'm, they're biting a little bit. And I put DEET on earlier because I was laying back in the hammock. But it is what it is. Got ice on Sunday, it's almost melted. I tried to eat up as much of the food. I mean, what doesn't, there isn't all that much to spoil. It does spoil at this point. I mean, I could get ice tomorrow, but I'll probably just skip it and, and toss the uh, leftover of the food. I don't know if I'm gonna have a fire tonight. It's pretty dry and it's hot. I'm I may just wanna lay in the hammock and uh, I can take the garbage home and you know, put it in the burnables and you know what can happen to it next time. But uh, yeah, it's been great. Hope you enjoyed this video of camping up at uh, Birkins Clearing.